All right, for the second part, what we're going to be doing is the mouth dissection. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to identify some of the things outside the mouth. So this circle right here that's over there, that's actually the ear of the frog. It's just called the tympanum. So there's a tympanum here and a tympanum here. And um, the frog's mouth is kind of like pretty tightly shut. So I'm going to cut through the muscle here in its jaw just so that I can more easily open up the mouth. So I'm cutting it to beyond the tympanum. Okay, so now that I have the mouth open, one of the things you've already done is you've, um, you've tried to figure out what you think that the frog uses its tongue for, how it uses its tongue. So I'm going to show you what the tongue actually looks like. So there is the tongue of the frog. Okay. And the frog's tongue, if you notice, has these little prongs at the end. The other thing that you note is that the frog's tongue is stuck at the front. So the idea that the frog lashes out its tongue like a, like a lasso is actually incorrect. The frog instead uses its tongue more like a mouse trap, where if the food item is here, it waits really patiently for something that it can eat to get up near it, and then its tongue will reach out like this, slam down onto it, and then pull back. And actually these little fingers right here actually grab onto the food and then bring it back into its mouth. So that's how it's using its tongue. It's whipping down and back. Now, this muscle right here can actually extend a lot farther, but again, because it's dead, the muscles are all fully contracted. Okay, now, the second part of this is where it's going to be, we're identifying the two holes that are in the back of its throat. Okay, so, yeah. So I'm going to turn it like that so you can see, and the two holes, if I hold that open like this, there's one hole that's actually right here. So as I go right here, that's kind of the big hole. All right, that's the big hole there, and then it has this little hole right here, which I'm going to use my dissecting needle for, okay? So that hole right there. So this hole right here is going to be called the glottis. And what you see is it has an open little a little slit right there to open up and then it normally stays shut. And then this one right here is called the gullet and it can open up pretty wide. So that should give you a clue as to which one it uses to swallow food and which one it uses to breathe air. A little piece of birthday light cake icing there. All right, so that concludes the mouth dissection. Hit stop.